hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my channel it is miss dark and lovely in today's vlog i'm sharing with you my experience in abitifi during the Kwe'u easter festivities this year let's get into this video but before we start like subscribe and say hello in the comments all right let's get into this video guys
as if he was doing his thing but we decided to head home a little bit earlier that night because if there's one thing I realized during this three-day festivities I realized that I am not in my 20s anymore because I was exhausted from just enjoying myself and having so much fun drive back was not so bad matter of fact we drove right past the rock city hotel and i could imagine all the events they had going on that weekend looked amazing from the outside Remember when I said we were gonna try to head home? Didn't happen because the traffic in Obama was at a standstill. No cars leaving, no cars coming in. We might as well go ahead and grab something to eat and that's what we did. <laughs> So my three-day weekend in Quo for the Easter celebrations was great. I had a lot of fun. I really got this vibe like it was kind of like a big neighborhood block party. You know, bringing everybody in the neighborhood together from the young, the old, everybody else in between. And I, I can tell people were just really happy to be out and about and socializing because the last two years Easter celebrations was canceled because of COVID so I really got the vibe that people were just happy to be out celebrating and just keeping the tradition going but unfortunately when we decided to leave we still could not find transportation so just when we were deciding to start walking down the mountain which would have probably taken us over an hour we saw a taxi which only had one seat so I was sitting on a stranger's lap <laughs> but it was either that or I was gonna have to walk it out and um, at that time in the middle of the morning you know I was like nah I'll just take my chances and just sit on somebody's lap <laughs> and that's what I did other than that fun experience worth the entire weekend learned so much about the environment the area so Feel free to check out some of my other videos on that three-day experience. Keep supporting us. I want this channel to grow as much as possible. I want you guys to see what it's like living in Ghana for real, for real. So thank you guys so much. As always, be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.